What area of the Browns needs to be addressed the most to make 2023 different? So 2023 mm -hmm. isn't a wait till next year. Um, this is I've been I, I've already been stewing in my mind over this. It's about defensive tackles, and it's about another receiver. The reason why I would slightly lean towards going to get the best receiver, a speed receiver I can, is because to me, you got to do everything you can to do, to to invest in Deshaun Watson. Um, Amari Cooper had a great year this year. Donovan Peoples Jones is a fine receiver, number two guy. Sweet. But when you go back and you want to unlock all of the attributes of, of Deshaun Watson, you got to go get you a Brandon Cooks. You got to go get you somebody that can run past people um, and catch the ball. Uh, excuse me, Anthony Schwartz. Um, you need somebody that can get vertical, catch the football, and, and unlock one of his best traits, which is the deep ball. I think the Browns need to score more. I think they need to have more explosive plays. And I think they need to revamp some of the concepts they have because – methodically plotting down the field, throwing five yards, stop routes and, and throwing stuff like that. That's not going to work uh, on a, on a sustained period of time. So for me, I, a close second out of that is, is defensive tackles. Um, you know, if they can get uh, Deron Payne uh, out of, uh, out of Washington. He'll be a free agent, but I think they might franchise tag him or sign him to a long-term deal. I think uh, linebacker, excuse me, defensive line is a huge thing for them. And now you're going to need a double defensive end unless you think uh, Alex Wright is the guy that's going to play well over there for you. So for me, I would say close is a receiver. Two, not not coming up that far behind his defensive tackle. And I think they need linebacker help as well. So we'll see if, if guys like Reggie Ragland and Fields can, you know, stick on this roster. But I say, I say it's all about the points. It's all about the throwing game. Give me a receiver and see what he can do in 2023. Yeah, I would agree with you. I think um, you don't need to go five yards a pop when you have the quarterback that the Browns now have. So um, getting that receiver might make it a high-powered offense.